This is Twit. Uh, we all knew, we talked about this at like day one, that AI would almost naturally somehow wind up being used by bad guys oh, yeah. to further their evil ends. So get a load of this one, which just happened last week. It took the form of a supply chain attack against the users of the popular NX tool, which is used to automate CICD development flow. You know, CICD, for those who don't know, stands for continuous integration, continuous delivery and deployment. So it's about software deployment automation. <clears throat> Last Tuesday, an unknown threat actor compromised the NPM identity authentication token of one of the NX developers and used their then authenticated access to release malicious updates for several of the NX tools to the NPM package repository. Now that alone is horrifying. The NX tools are very popular, seeing around 4.6 million weekly downloads. So that was a serious breach of a trusted NPM developer, which allowed malicious code to flow out of the trusted repository. But listen to what the malware did. The altered NPM packages contained a malicious script that attempted to run a prompt on a local AI command line tool like oh, wow. Claude, Gemini, <laughs> or Q and the prompt instructed the, the local AI agents on that machine to search the local file system, which <gasps> it had access to for text-based files that <sighs> might contain GitHub tokens, NPM tokens, SSH keys, .env secrets and wallet files. And all the data discovered locally was then encrypted and written to a file. Oh. The subsequent command then used the GitHub API to create a new public repository on the infected user's GitHub account and upload the file with all the stolen data. So, you know, you get your local trusted AI agent to scan your own machine for its secrets, then encrypt them before posting them publicly. And since they're encrypted, no one else is able to decrypt them and get a hold of the secrets. So talk about diabolical. All of the public GitHub repos, which were created containing stolen data, used the same prefix, which was singularity with a numeral one for the I of in, in, in singular singularity hyphen repository hyphen was the prefix that made them easy to find on GitHub, which is probably how the attacker collected the stolen data. According to a GitHub search, there were around 1400 GitHub repositories oh with my. that prefix, huh. which was roughly the same number of users. The attacker had infected before the malicious NX libraries were taken off NPM. So around 1400 developers had their local machines scoured by their own local AI agents for any juicy tidbit secrets with everything found posted back to their GitHub accounts where they were collected and then decrypted by the bad guys. Wow. That is a very clever <laughs> hack. That is really interesting. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, I hope you enjoyed these little highlights from our shows. We do a bunch of them, and they're all available on the web at twit.tv or right here on YouTube. You can even watch most of them live on YouTube. I'll tell you what, you'll see a link below. And if you would like, and I would like it, like and subscribe. Thanks so much for watching. Security.